Hello, my name is Nicole Bennett and welcome to my YouTube channel. Support your child with their attention, with their listening and their speech. In my chatter box and I'm just, this is a normal box that I've just made and I'm going to use it to show you how to uh, make uh, attention skills. So on top of the box I've got um clothing things that you wear we've got animals and we've got food so i've separated the box and you see I've, I've got a slit in each side so it's about children putting in when you open inside the box has got partition so in each section there are all the fruits them that i'm going to be using all the animals that i'm going to be putting in and also all the different clothes that we wear so i've parted the box in three as you can see so that makes it easier for you or for the child when they when you put the toys in and at the end of it so this is a box so we this is my chatter box that i'm using today and as you can see on the top we've got that so what it is so you're working with a child and so you have all your food stem and you've got all your animals and you've got all the different clothing so this is how you use this with your child so if you are learn, teaching a child about fruit, so you take up the fruit and you want them to identify what the fruit is. So you probably use start with a fruit that they might know, a tomato, a mango, pineapple. So we have different fruits here. And then you are going to ask the child to put it in the correct place. So um, these are fruits, so that you'd want the child to be able to put it in this one. And when you are doing it with the child, you can say what it is. So you hand it to the child and the child take it and you then will say the word apple because you're getting the child to sound word. So apple, 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 and then you hand it to the child for the child to put it in the correct slot. And they'll just easily put it in. So again, you're there using the fine motor skills because they have to hold it to get it in like that. And so each time you call the name of the, the fruit and whatever, close it in so they can recognize. So you get them to recognize different things So top, and they'll put it where we have the sign that says things we wear. So we all wear a top. So they put it into this slot. And then you have different clothing. Probably you will say this is a shorts. Again, so you put it in where things that you wear. You wear shorts. We all wear shorts. We have shoes. We have tops. We have different clothing items. Pants. And the child will just uh, so that you can sit and the child you get the child to focus and concentrate for probably five ten minutes they will be able to sit and do this and you can make it exciting shoes and but you tell the child what it is and you hand it to them so repeat the word three times at least and for them to put it in these so I've, as you can see have got a, quite a, a, a layer so we have animals different animals or animals from the form the horse that they can recognize the chicken, the donkey, the duck. Yeah, so they can recognize all of these and then they can put it in and you can tell them we've got a goat, chicken. And so they can recognize this. And you can also, so that's one of one way you can use it. You can also use it as um, a lottery. So you can have two sets. Another way to do this is have two sets of the of the fruits and so you can give them one or you put them out and have them to recognize and show you or point to the fruit on the table. So you can have fruits on the table, you can have animals, you can, you can have a mixture of things on the table and ask them to show you or pick up the, 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 the item that you want them to recognize. So that's another way of, of, of doing the game. And so you can do this and this is teaching them to recognize different things. It's also teaching them to, and they can call the words. So you can say to them, okay, um, let me point to the grape. And if you have shown them on before, and so they know that's grape, and you can then say to them, okay, pick the grape, and they can then, their reward is put in the, in the box and see how many they get correctly. So thank you. And if you have not yet subscribed to my YouTube channel, please click the link below and subscribe. And if you are not, um, share the link with others, join others. So once a week, I'll be putting up different teaching sessions that you can do with your child to help them to learn their speech, for their speech, their concentration 
and listening skills because they have to listen carefully to the words that you're saying. So thank you for listening and thank you. And this is Nicole and we've been looking at Raising Children the Kingdom Way. Thank you for now and see you in our next video next week.